Hey guys, just a real quick video about a recall that has been released a couple of days ago on August 4th, I believe, um, DeWalt Compound Miter Saws. My saw is a DWS779, and there are two others involved. I believe there's two others. I will leave a link in um, the description below to the website, uh, DeWalt site, where you can check the information to see if your saw is involved, and fill out the form online and they'll send you a repair kit for free I've already done it mine is of course involved I've already done it and they say to stop using the saw immediately and I should have the repair kit in uh, one to two weeks thank God I'm not a contractor and I don't use this every day or yeah I'd be rolling the dice but apparently the recall is for this piece here they call it a, uh, a rear safety guard. I guess what happens is this guard can break, get caught in the blade, shoot out, and tear you up. Apparently there has been quite a few instances where it has broken, and I think there were nine documented people who uh, received lacerations from flying shards. So, on the 779 anyway, the information that you need is right up here on top of the motor. And the build date is stamped in here on this black shroud. If after the serial number, which is here, there's a green dot, you're not involved. And mine doesn't have either, so I'm not 100% sure. But someplace under here, a black dot, check the website to make sure, but a black dot also means you're not involved. But yeah, I just uh, thought that might be important. Don't want to see anybody out there getting hurt because of a default in DeWalt. <laughs> and, um, yeah, I just wanted to make this real quick video to make people aware that there is a recall. Parts are free. Just fill out the form and, uh, you know, check your date codes and everything else to see if you qualify or if it needs to be done. I don't want to say qualify. But anyway, I'll leave the information in the description below. And hopefully you guys aren't involved in this. If I need mine, I'm going to be using it. I'm not going to wait two weeks for the parts. I just finished building a 10 by 16 deck, and I use this to cut pretty much every board. No problems with mine, but the next time I use it, who knows, it may explode. But anyway, you guys have a great day, and uh, yeah, we'll talk soon. Take care.